this is Alyssa, and today we are going to feed our black soldier fly larva a ton of food. Okay, let's see what we got. Whoa. So we got a lot of grapefruits and some bread who's actually not moody. But it's old and hard, right? Yeah. Okay, so this is what our setup looks like. It's a kiddie pool with some worm trays filled with larvae and food. Yeah. So we've got plenty of larvae like this in these tubs. They're in a bedding that's made out of shredded paper and shredded cardboard. It's pretty much just like worm bedding. And for the food, we use all kinds of old, rotten fruit and vegetable scraps. So go ahead and add some more, Alyssa. Okay. I'm gonna put some bread. Put some old, hard hamburger buns. It's hard. <laughs> okay, put it down, please. Grapefruit, turn it over so that the soft side is down. They like the soft side a lot better than the rind. Yeah. Pieces of bread. Flip the bread over so that the soft white part is down, please. Okay. I'm going to put four pieces of bread, four pieces of grapefruit. Okay, fill up the whole top, because remember they eat so fast. Yeah. They're going to power through all of this pretty much by tomorrow, I bet. Yes. That's good. Okay, so by tomorrow you think it's going to be gone? Yeah, I think so. Okay. This is your little friend. He's crawling away. You don't have to pet it, honey. Smelling it? What does it smell like? <laughs> Not much of anything, huh? The black soldier fly larvae appear to leave a lot of food behind, but when you take a closer look, the things that look like skins are really just like paper thin. Well, it's basically just the very tiniest scrap from the wrapper and the sticker and even like the grapefruit rind is down to like paper paper thin these here are the tiny babies that just hatched from eggs not long ago they're probably like five days old or less See, there's a ton of them in this grapefruit. They're just everywhere. They're just swarming down in the bin here. <laughs> 